Howdy y'all, Mr. Kazi coming to you from beautiful Atascacita, Texas. And I just wanted to stop and give you a little tip on sig figs or significant figures. It's really important that you understand significant figures and that you learn the rules of significant figures because that helps keep our data straight and the integrity of our data. And so remember that when you're measuring significant figures are all the readable digits plus one guess. And that's usually to either the tenths or hundredths place. You should be able to get one or two decimals on almost every measurement tool that you have. And I'm pretty sure that no matter what lab you're in, the tools are going to be pretty accurate. What's going to help you get your precision is how well you can read um, that tool and actually get uh, the right sig figs. And when you get the right sig figs and uh, make that proper guess, you're going to be able to maintain the integrity and you're going to be able to help out when, you, when it comes to calculations. So go ahead and make sure that you uh, understand significant figures, that you practice significant figures, and watch my videos on significant figures and using them in calculations so you can learn the rules. So I'm going to put links down below and I'm going to put some links up here in the cards and there'll be some links at the end of the video so that you can go and watch and make sure that you get your sig figs in order. Alright, good luck everyone and Happy Ions.